Hi everyone, my name is John English and today I want to do a very quick video on cryptocurrency currency wallets or Bitcoin wallets. I get a lot of questions, John, which Bitcoin wallet do you use? Because if you want to start up a, a, a cryptocurrency business, you need a wallet. If you want to buy Bitcoins, you need a wallet. Well, my friends, when I looked at what wallet I wanted to do, which is fairly recent, I had a good look around and in my opinion, Coinbase seem to be the best. It's easy to use, it's good for the newbie, and it seemed very secure. So I choose Coinbase. So my friends, do your due diligence, choose which one you want. I find Coinbase absolutely fantastic for what I need out of the business. So how to get started? Coinbase, if you go to their website, this is what you'll see. So all you need to do is enter your email address and get started. My friends, in this video, I'm just going to go through as quick as I can this process. Okay, so if you join from a referral link, somebody invites you to join, or for example, you click the link below my videos or whatever, which has a, a link, you'll you, you'll get someone like this. This has benefits for both parties. For example, if you sign up with these links, okay, once you use a hundred dollars. In buying and selling Bitcoin or more, you learn ten dollars worth of free Bitcoin, and so will your referrer. They learn ten dollars of bit free Bitcoin as well. So there's benefits for both parties, which you don't get, of course, if you just join directly on their website. So it's worth looking at that, my friends. It's why not get ten dollars worth of free Bitcoin rather than not. So when you sign up from one of these forms, first name, last name email address now i must emphasize right at the very beginning my friends when you put in your new email addresses make sure the proper the proper email addresses because they will send you a confirmation link to your inbox on that email address which you have to click to confirm your own that email so don't start with dummy emails and all that black right from day one day one in your account make sure you use your proper name proper email address proper home address proper postcode stroke zip code etc keep it right and you'll you'll set up your coinbase account fine if you've got any of them wrong they do all the confirmation checks they won't give you an account okay so get everything right right from day one so then you choose a password make sure it's a strong one because after all it is a wallet okay so make sure it's a strong password click i'm not a robot in the capture page and agree to their con terms and condition and sign up okay my friend so as i say you will come to their site you'll have to log in and sign in okay they'll ask you they've already you've already confirmed your email address to get in they'll then ask you to confirm your mobile phone number so you put your mobile phone number in they'll send you a text with a code in a, dig, a digit code you then enter that code onto the site and that will confirm to them that you own your mobile phone so you've confirmed your email address your mobile phone now you've got to add a payment method now for us in the uk i'm in the uk for us in the uk and most of europe we can set up with just a credit or debit card okay instantaneous put the details in your card and they'll do all the security checks on it check that you own it and then bingo it's done pretty instantly okay we don't have to have a bank account however i must emphasize if you have a if you set up a bank account with them you get higher limits on your coinbase account than if you've just got a credit or debit card i've just got a credit card in there i find that quite sufficient for my needs my requirement for the site up to the individual whether you have a bank account and a credit or debit card if you want to withdraw money to your bank account of course you'll need to register that with them now that's for us in the uk and the majority of europe in the usa it's slightly different you have to set up a bank account first now from what i'm led to believe if you are in one of the major banks it's pretty straightforward you enter your details get the which you get off your your checkbook or your, your bank statement enter that and if you've got online banking they'll do all the security checks and it's pretty quick however if you're in one of the smaller regional banks it can take a bit longer if, if that bank's not on their list you've got to enter your bank name your bank the details it can take four to five working days so there is a bit of a lag in your setting up your account 
then once this is for the USA once you've got your bank account registered and you can then set up a credit credit and debit card on to your Coinbase site okay so you in the USA you've got your bank account first register that and then you can register your credit and debit card that's what I've been led to believe by watching the videos and talking to my friends in the States okay so you've set up your bank account now so you've got a method of payment so quickly what do what how can we use this account okay so go to the dashboard okay up here there's a drop down menu this is where you can account details and you can log out by clicking your name this is how you log out the account okay the little drop down comes in there this is your dashboard tells you how many bitcoins you've got in there as you see i pretty well spend mine i'm waiting some more to come in i pretty well spent mine recently okay and so that tells you your balance and here this is quite a little little interesting tool it shows you the actual uh, price chart of bitcoin as you see it's just going up and up and up if you click up there that's over a month that's over the year look it's climbing colossally over the week it's it's just going up and up and up at the moment okay my friend so this shows your recent activity okay you say that's money that's bitcoins paid into my account that's bitcoins paid out of my account okay so how do you buy bitcoin click on buy sell okay choose what you want to buy bitcoin the payment method i've only got the one but you could have other payment methods in their bank account etc okay now see that i've only got because i've only registered a credit card i've got a weekly limit of a hundred pounds okay now if you've got a bank account in there that could be more okay that's the benefit of having bank accounts so I want to I want to buy Bitcoin so let's say I want to buy ah, 50 pounds worth 50 pounds worth or if you're in the States be $50 worth whatever you can see that I've used half my weekly card limit that gives me 0 0.5209 and bits of Bitcoin okay it's going to cost me to buy that 52 pounds that's quite good I can live with that I can live with two pound commission okay I can live with that so all you do is buy them instantly like that and then you click confirm to buy simple as that i'm choosing not to at this present moment on this video but you just confirm to buy okay and then if you go to your bash dashboard pretty instantaneously you'll find the bitcoins you just bought in here in the bitcoin bid here okay so how about if you want to send bitcoins to well selling it's got to sell your bitcoin you just press sell okay sell from your bitcoin wallet deposit to your euro wallet pound pound wallet whatever wallet you've set up you want to send it to there okay and you just put the figure in that tell you how many bitcoins okay and then sell bitcoin instantly and it would obviously be removed from your bitcoin wallet and move to your other wallet okay so that's straightforward straightforward okay now how about if you want to pay somebody right this is you want to send funds to someone they will give you a hash now what does a hash look like it's a long series i'll show you what your hash will look like okay so i'll show you what your hash will look like so going to accounts you find your bitcoin address under your bitcoin wallet go across there's your bitcoin address that is a hash okay copy that that is a hash okay so we'll go back to send and request so they'll provide you with a hash which will look something like yours okay be a lot of different numbers of course and a lot of different letters but it looks something like that okay each one's unique to the uh, person's account that's just to tell coinbase who to pay okay so you put the amount in let's say you wanted to you're obviously going to have to have enough in your bitcoin wallet but let's say i had 0.32 
whatever the figure is it could whatever figure is you'd have to have enough of your bitcoin wallet write a message in here hi this is a payment from john english or whatever you want to write and send the funds and that will go to that recipient okay that will go to that recipient so if they ask for your hashtag to pay you you know where to get it from you go into accounts get your bitcoin address and that is your hashtag that you give somebody to pay you so my friend once you get have a look around it once you're in it have a look around it so setting it up okay is is pretty simple as i say i haven't gone through all the bits and bobs you know your address you know your name it's all them have got to be filled in you know all that sort of stuff so that's a, a brief round quick summary of setting up a coinbase as i say i found them really good i did my personal due diligence they were they looked as if they're highly recommended secure and everything else and i'm really happy with it so my friends i'll leave a link below if you want to join coinbase click on the link below i'll make a video in the next few days about how i'm getting on in my other businesses but i say coinbase really good i can recommend it so i'll speak to you all soon my friends any questions message me on facebook i'll leave my facebook uh, link up on the screen and if you're watching me on youtube it'll be obviously below that okay my friends you take care i'll speak to you on the next video bye for now